All right, so kept you waiting, everybody. I am, I am, I am Ryan Snake here with Revolver Broccolot. I'm Colonel. No, you're Rev- <laughs> your Revolver Broccolot. I don't want to. And you're just twirling your revolvers. <laughs> you're just playing a good old game of like Russian roulette, but with blanks. Bang. Yeah, they're just blanks. Or is it? It's not real bullets. It's blanks. One real bullet. No, it's a bl- it's a blank. It's a blank. Okay, so anyway, in the last Ooh. episode, Brock missed out on this because he had to call his girlfriend at the time, right? No, he she mi- called me. Yeah, she called you, but you missed out on something, all right? What you missed out on was that I now know Otacon's codec frequency. And it and it's very important that you know about this because you're going to need to call him at one point in the game. And that is 141.12. You still haven't found Meryl? Snake. The Warhead Storage Building that And yes, his nickname is Otacon. So you <laughs> So you can call him that. Why don't you search there too? Otacon. Uh, cuz he likes anime. Yeah, it's it's short for Otaku Convention. Is Taku Convention? Otaku, like like anime. Mm-hmm. Otaku is a is like is like a type of anime, I think. Mm-hmm. Or it's like a person who likes anime. Mm-hmm. I guess it's like Weeb Fest. He's such a weeaboo. And here's that PlayStation. In its 32-bit glory. Go next to us, that one. What this? Yeah. That's just a Windows 98, like, tower. I, I, I thought that was a, a big, huge Xbox. <laughs> you thought that was an Xbox? <laughs> yeah. Well, Xboxes do look that shitty. Ha <laughs> ha! Well, you know about the new Xbox coming? It looks like a damn fridge. Yeah, it does. And with the n- new PS5, if you get the one terabyte, it looks like a vacuum clear head. Like, um, yeah, you have free, you have free, you put a bunch of beams on it. Here's, here's, here's the Xbox series. It's a fridge. Here's the guy open the fridge. It's an <laughs> Xbox. Here, here's the PS, PS5. A lady's just vacuuming with the PS5. I you know, like, the, what the fuck? You know that one commercial with, um, with the, with the guy like, Hi, I'm Pete Wallman, and then a fridge falls behind him. You need a new refrigerator? Yes. <laughs> Alright, so what we gotta do now is we're gonna be fighting Psycho Mantis now. So you know what that means, Brock? What? You're gonna need to pull out your camera, and you're gonna need to see. You're gonna need to record for the audience what is gonna happen in the real world for that for that boss fight. Cause that boss fight has a cool trick. This is the boss fight. Yeah, this is the boss fight. We're gonna fight. We're gonna fight um Psycho Mantis. You don't have to worry about it yet, right? We're we're getting there. We're gonna get there. It zoomed in. Are you already recording right now? You're already recording right now? No, I'm just doing your eyeball. Or are you just messing with me right now? I'm just messing around with you. You're, you're just messing with me? <laughs> Why don't you take a picture? Does the picture look glorious? Does it look glorious? I'm gorgeous. <laughs> just your eye. Look, you look just, how focused it is. You just took a picture of my eye? Like, yeah. Like for no reason. Uh-huh. All right, so, We're so focused. All right, so what we need to do, there's actually a cool Easter egg before this boss fight. All right, so one of these guards right here. One of these guards right here, Brock. Oh, you hear that music? You hear that? You hear that music? <laughs> you hear that music? Mm-hmm. That's like a hypnotic mind control music. Um, so what we gotta do is we gotta we gotta face one of the guards, and then we need to follow this guard. We need to follow this guard. <laughs> He's See, just running. What is this showing you? This guard is Meryl. That's Meryl. Oh. But here's what I'm gonna do. All right. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna wait for the wait for wait for her to come back out because if you actually catch her. Um, if you actually get, if you actually catch her to the stall really, really quickly, then you can see her without her pants on. Uh, there's two guards now. There we go. Now hurry, 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 hurry to the stall and move. And Meryl will be up without her pants if you do this. If you do this really fast. 
That's the second time I've been able to sneak up on the legendary solid See? snake. See? <laughs> she doesn't have her pants on. You're Meryl. There's no way you could pass for a man for I didn't have enough time to take mean? to put on my pants put my pants back on. I had no idea you were so feminine. This is no time to try and hit on me, Snake. The clothes are right there. Besides, it's a way this is good old Hideo Kojima stuff right here. Classic Hideo Kojima. Same Nothing like him. You're Meryl, all right. Are you hurt? Not yet. After all, I was disguised as a genome soldier. So why'd you change? You'd be a lot better off dressed like one of them. I got tired of disguising myself. The truth is, the uniform smelled like blood. What's that mark? Huh? Oh, this? It's a paint tattoo. It's not real. I was a fan of Foxhound way back. Wait, Foxhound that was a Foxhound tattoo? Forward. That just looks no, like a bunch of gobbledygook. Like there mm -hmm. is today. You guys were real heroes. There are no heroes in war. All the heroes I know are either dead or in prison. One or the other. But Snake, you're a hero, aren't you? You see butt cheeks. I'm just a man who's good at what he does. Yeah, you do. <laughs> There's no winning or losing for a mercenary. The only winners in war are the people. That's right, and you fight for the people. I've never fought for anyone but myself. I've got no purpose in life, no ultimate goal. Come on. It's only when I'm cheating death on the battlefield. The only time I feel truly alive. The, main, the name means, means nothing on the battlefield. Alive, huh? You love war and don't want it to stop? Is it the same with all great soldiers throughout history? Why didn't you contact me? My codec was broken. Is that all? Shouldn't you just be happy we met up like this? How did you recognize me? Yeah, we met up with you with your pants me. off in a, so in a woman's bathroom. You like about me, huh? Yeah, you've got a great butt. <laughs> oh, I see. First it's my eyes, now it's my butt. What's next? Your back. boobs. You never think about what's next. Next is the boobs. <laughs> she literally just has block. She just has like a blocky pair of breasts. It's just a block. How are the negotiations going? No. That's the good old days of the PS1, where everything so was blocky. You, huh? Somebody's got to stop them from launching oh, a nuclear missile. Oh, because all they did was the shape is a there box. Yep. Either we I destroy Metal it. Gear or we override the detonation code. You got the card keys from Baker. Because you're not able to do this. It was like this. this. Where are the others? Yeah, you're this able to only make like low poly this models. Is all I've got. Like, what if they don't want to I have no idea, but they must be somewhere. If we can't find them, mm -hmm. we'll have no choice but to destroy Metal Gear. Metal Gear is in an underground maintenance base to the north. Take me too. I know this place better than you do. You'll just slow me down. You don't have enough battle experience. I won't slow you down. I promise. And what if you do? Then you can shoot me. You know, first time I played this, I wanted to shoot Meryl. Got it. Why? Because she would slow I'll me be down. Careful. Hmm. You know, I don't use makeup the way other women do. I hardly ever look at myself in the mirror. I've always despised that kind of woman. I always dreamed of becoming a soldier. And then when you and get to MGS4, she's a complete badass. It wasn't really my dream. Right now, she doesn't know her place yet. He but in MGS4, she becomes a complete badass. It's really. awesome. I thought that if I became a soldier, I could understand him better. So are you a soldier yet? I thought I was until today. But now I understand. The truth is, I was just afraid of looking at myself. Afraid of having to make my own decisions in life. But I'm not going to lie to myself anymore. It's time I took a long, hard look at myself. I want to know who I am. What I'm capable of. I want to know why I've lived the way I've lived until now. I want to know. Take a good look. You won't get another chance for a while. You should wash your face, too, while you're at it. Yeah. This isn't a training exercise. Our lives are riding on this. There are no heroes or heroines. If you lose, you're worm food. That's life for you. Yeah. If you lose, you're worm that food. Is functional? That's the way I see the world. Unfortunately, it's out of ammo. Where did you get that Desert Eagle? I found it in the armory. It's a 50 caliber Action Express. There was a SOCOM pistol too, but I chose this. Huh, so I got a leftover, huh? Isn't that yeah, so the gun we found was a leftover Don't SOCOM. Worry, I can handle it. Come on, use my 45. Listen, I've used a gun like this since I was eight years old. I'm more comfortable with it than I am with a bra. And she has like a little magazine in between her tits. If we're gonna go to the north, we'll have to go through the commander's room on this floor. The overland one is blocked by glaciers. 
Well, she doesn't even. She's not even wearing a bra. The door to the actually, room is security level five. Oh. She said um, she she said she's more comfortable with a desert eagle than she is with a bra. Looks like he must have been guarding oh. someplace. And that is implying that she doesn't have one on. Oh. You don't have one. It's gonna fall right down. Okay, let's go. Why are you just playing the million boobs? You. Yeah, that's what she did. She put it in her cleavage. Follow oh. me. All right. So now here's another Easter egg I gotta show. All right, before we fight That's Psycho strange. Mantis. There's no guard. What happened to the music? Oh, the music I'll disappeared. Make sure you're ready, okay? All right, so here's a here's a cool Easter egg. Here's a cool Easter egg. All you gotta do is hold triangle. Look at Meryl. Actually, I'll get a closer look. All right. And just hold it there. Just wait. Mm. Just keep what? on waiting. What is it? You'll see. You'll see. It's very slow, but you just need to wait. What are you staring at? You'll see it. You'll see it. Come on, snake. You see the slight change yet? No. Let me know when you see it. Don't stare at me like that. You see it yet? Hmm. Am I supposed to be looking at? <laughs> what do you, you see doing? it now? We've got to get a move on. You see it yet? Just let me know when you see it. I'm just gonna look away and just keep holding the triangle button until you see what? it. What is it? Tell me when you see it. See what? What are you staring at? Is she getting mad or something? I don't know what it is. Show me. Come on, snake. Do you see what's going on? He's flirting. Do you see it yet? Don't stare at me like that. Mm -hmm. What is it? You'll see it. You'll see it. <laughs> it's, what it's are you still doing? Going. Yeah. We've got to get a move on. You gotta keep doing it for a really long time. Wow. Well, You'll see it. You'll see it. What? What is it? You see the slight changes yet? Huh, see you think. Did, uh, did, what are you staring did, 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 did the boobs went smaller? No. No. Come on, snake. The hair? No, not the hair. No. Come on, you can figure this out. Don't the stare face? at me like that. See what's going on? <laughs> what are you doing? We've got to get a move on. She's turning red. That's turning the red. Yeah, she's turning red. She's getting embarrassed. Oh. She's blushing. Mm -hmm. And now her animations are changing because she's because she's blushing so much. <laughs> See? Mm -hmm. What are you staring at? All right, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I've had my fun. <laughs> Okay, now it's time for you to turn on your phone and start recording me from your perspective, okay? All right, so you ready? You got this ready? Let me know when you got it ready. You got it running? All right, so here's what we're going to do. Here's the key, everybody. What we're going to be doing is now we're going to be fighting Psycho Mantis, and you guys are going to see the cool trick on how to defeat him. Now, if you're playing on a PS3, you've got to turn on the <laughs> options menu and got to do all, all this complicated stuff. But really? since we're using a PlayStation Classic... Is it complicated on the PS3? It's a little bit more complicated on the PS3, yeah. But on the PlayStation Classic, it's very simple, actually. All right? You got the camera, camera showing the PlayStation Classic? It's very simple, actually. Very easy. You'll see what happens. My head. Oh, it hurts. So right now, Meryl, Meryl's head is in serious oh, pain right now me. because um, Psycho Mantis is trying to take over her mind because, you know, she's got, he's got psychic powers and all that. I'm actually surprised that Psycho Mantis didn't, like, didn't, like, try to make her head explode or something like that. That could have been really intense, actually. What happened? And I, I think that would cause the, play, the PS1 to explode if that happened. It would just cause the frame rate to absolutely shit the bed. Okay. Let's go. 
Oh, she's being mind controlled right now. Come on, Mr. Foxhound. The commander is waiting. You can tell she's being mind controlled right now because she sounds like a gas. She's talking through a gas mask. Hmm. I'm fine. Come on, Mr. Foxhound. <laughs> it's Snake. It's Solid Snake. All right, so now it seems like nobody's here at first. So it's like, okay, I'll just leave. Or you just like keep running around the place and then all of a sudden this happens. Snake, how oh, do you like me? Yes. What the? Do you like me? Hold me, Snake. What's wrong? Oh, oh, hurry, hurry, make love to me. Not when you're pointing a gun at me. Now nah, you're just being a creep, Psychomantis. Snake, Meryl's not herself. Don't use your weapon. It's Psychomantis. He's controlling Meryl. That tune is his mind control music. Don't use your weapon. Try to knock her out. You got it, Colonel. There we go. Just gotta knock out Meryl. This is just part of the game design, guys. Don't worry, it's just part of the game design. You're not supposed to do that, girl. But that's what you're supposed to do in the game. It's just part of the game design. You just have to do it. Alright, so there's this part of the game where Psychomantis would read your memory card. And if I was playing this on the PS3, he would be saying like, You like Castlevania, don't you? Because I would be playing I would I would have had Castlevania on my memory card. But the PlayStation Classic doesn't have Castlevania on it, so he won't say that. He'll just read your memory card of what games you've played that you saved on the PlayStation Classic. But if you didn't save anything, he'll just say, Your memory is completely clean. So watch, he reads your memory card of what games you've played on the PlayStation Classic, or the PS3, or PS1, depending on whatever you played. All right, so he checks your saving. That's correct. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's right, that's right. Hey, I'm very cautious, man. Not a coward. Now this is the part where he reads your memory card. Hmm. Your memory is completely clean. Yeah, because oh. I, because I didn't play any other games on the PlayStation Classic. Hmm. Metal Gear Solid was the you only game I played on here. You are somewhat reckless. I can read you like an open book. Alright, so here's where the part gets here's where the game gets really screwy. So right now you guys think that the that the TV's broken, but in reality I'm playing on a on a computer with a console recorder. So then all of a sudden. So now I gotta pause the game real quick. Now this is the cool part, alright? Here's the cool part. Now what you do with the PlayStation Classic or PS1 is you gotta take the control the controller port port. You gotta plug it into the second into the second port. Cause if you have it plugged into the first one, Psychomantis will be able to read your mind. But with but if you plug it into the second one, he can no longer read your mind afterwards. If you're doing this with the PS3, you gotta turn on the option setting and then you gotta select controller port two. Alright, that's what you gotta do guys. So now that we have that settled, we can now turn off the phone. And now we can continue the fight like normal. That must have been very awkward, wasn't it, Brock? You were basically just holding the camera the entire time, just trying to figure out what I was trying to do. 
Trust me, that's only the second time we're gonna, that's only the second time that we'll be doing it for this entirety of the Metal Gear Solid Let's Play. We will be doing it one more time as well. One more time on here, but don't worry, that's after we fight Sniper Wolf for the second time, not the first time. So now, I'm gonna fight him. All right, here we go. I really gotta concentrate for this, so here we go. So now, I gotta use thermal goggles. All right, now I gotta, I gotta shoot him in the face. There we go. Yeah, there we go. All right, duck down, crouch down, and then bam. All right, and boom. Bam. Right, come on, come on, come on. Okay, that got him. I got him there. All right. Bam, okay. Bam, okay. Come on, come on, come on. He, he's invisible, yeah. I have to use thermal goggles so that way I can see him. Because I plugged into the second port, stupid. Okay, and now I gotta, I gotta put, I gotta take out my, I gotta take out my gun. I guess I could just leave it out. Bam, 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 bam. All right, come on. Bam, bam, bam. All right, don't die, Meryl, don't die. You are powerful indeed, but I know your weak point. Meryl, stand right where he can see you and blow your brains out. No, don't do it, Meryl. Don't do it, Meryl. Meryl, no! Don't do it, Meryl! No! It cannot be! No! Yes, Psychomantis. Yes. Yes. Alright. I think I'm good on the health. But now I just gotta follow Psychomantis, and I just gotta keep shooting him. There we go. There we go. There we go. Yeah, I almost got him. All right, good, 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 and boom. Okay, he's one more hit away. One more hit away. All right, now, bam! Yeah! He gets behind the decks. Yeah, that's that's supposed to happen. Oh. Colonel. Your niece is going to be okay. Thanks, Snake. Yeah, I know, yeah. I know you won. Now that Mantis is beaten. Yeah, you know, Meryl is the Colonel's off, niece. Right, yes. But why did you go so far out of your way to save her? For Campbell's sake, or maybe it's because you like her? For Campbell's well, I sake. See any woman and I guess right it's because me. I do like her. Oh, really? Since when did anybody I guess a snake, I guess. So much? Naomi, In this game, at least. It's true that Snake has killed a lot of people. But that doesn't mean he doesn't have a heart. It's okay, Colonel. She's right. <laughs> so, you used the other... I, I wasn't able to read the future. Because I control, I put the controller the port into the second future. one. And now I'm gonna put it back. <laughs> Perhaps so. But I will read your future. I am reading your mind, Snake, and it seems you were born without a penis. You have to go through that hidden door. There's a hidden door behind the bookcase. The overland route. It's blocked by frozen glaciers. Go past the communication towers and use the tower's walkway. Why are you telling me this? 
I can read people's minds. In my lifetime, I have read the past, presents, and futures of thousands upon thousands of men and women. Oh, gross. Gross PS1 graphics. I peered into was stuffed with the same single object of obsession. That selfish and atavistic desire to pass on one seed. see the face. So everybody, so every person that he's whose mind he's read has always thought of sex. I, I can understand that. Pass on that DNA. We designed that way, and that's why there is war. Where's there's war because everybody is horny. <laughs> You're the same as us. We have no past, no future. We because you home. have no penis. That's our only purpose. And neither do I. <laughs> Humans weren't designed to bring each other happiness. From the moment we're thrown into this world. You never see his face. We're fated to bring each other nothing but pain oh, that's and misery. <laughs> yeah, PS1 graphics, nasty. The first person whose mind I dove into was my father's. Actually, he kind of looks like Zaz almost. Disgust and hatred for me. In Batman Arkham Asylum. My mother died in childbirth. And he despised me for it. I thought my father was going to kill me. That's when my future disappeared. I lost my past as well. When I came to, the village was engulfed in flames. Are you saying that you burned your village down to bury your past? I see that you have suffered the same. You actually do meet Psychomancis <laughs> again in Metal Gear Solid 5. <laughs> and you'll see what he's talking about then. We're truly the same, you and I. world is a more interesting place with people like you in it. You also meet him again in 4, but in that one he's a ghost. So, I wouldn't count that. Revolution. His dreams of world conquest do not interest me. I just wanted an excuse to kill as many people as I could. You monster. Let him talk. He doesn't have much time left. I've seen through evil. You, Snake, you're just like the boss. No, you're worse. Compared to you, I'm not so bad. I read her mind as well. Meryl's? I saw you there. You have a large place in her heart. A large place? Oh, that's nice. She secretly likes him. Yes. A large place. Well, it's actually pretty obvious, but actually. Because you were looking at her? Yeah. His face, her face right yeah, I was just staring at her and she just kept blushing. Yeah, that was pretty obvious. My mask. Put it back on. Okay. Like this. Other people's thoughts force their way into my mind before I die. I want to be by myself. I want to be left alone in my own world. I'll open the door for you. If you want to find your future, go through that door. It's like the secret entrance to the back cave almost. Well, he's dead. Let's go, Meryl. I'm sorry. Meryl? Meryl? How could I let Mantis control my mind like that? If you're gonna doubt yourself, I'll leave you here. Meryl. You're right. 
Never doubt yourself. Just let it make you stronger. Learn something from it. You're right. I'm sorry. I won't do it again. Snake, can I ask you something? What? About what Mantis said. I was just wondering. What? What's the problem now? Oh, no, nothing. So, tell me, Snake. What's your name? Your real name. A name means nothing on the battlefield. How name old are means you? nothing old on the battlefield. to know what death looks like. Any family? No, but I was raised by many people. Is there anyone you like? I've never been interested in anyone else's life. So you are all alone. Just like Mantis said. Other people just complicate my life. I don't like to get involved. You're a sad, lonely man. Come on. Let's go. He wants to be lonely. Okay, so now what I'm going to do real quick is I'm going to save with Mei Ling and I'm going to continue and press on forward. Dying men enforce attention like deep harmony. Snake people don't normally lie with their dying breath. I think he was telling the truth. Maybe <coughs> you should believe him. For Sandy, it's Sandy. You're trying to send the uh, you're trying to send the video to me? Mhm. Mm Please, Nick, don't give up. Thanks, Mei Ling. So now, I think it's time for us to press on forward. We're just gonna keep on going forward. Also, Meryl's got very low health. I wish there was a way I could heal it. But it's like I got a little buddy beside me. Imagine if this game was two player. <laughs> Man, would that drag on for the ca camera, right? Mm -hmm. Metal Gear Solid multiplayer mode. That's basically Peace Walker's online mode and Phantom Pan's online mode. Could there be wolves in there? Wolf dogs. Half wolf, half husky. How do you know so much? I ride dog sleds. I'm a musher. <gasps> I'll take point. Oh, wolves. Snake, you follow me. Oh, I wonder who that could lead up to. Sniper Wolf? I'm jamming, I'm jamming out, yeah. Yeah, you're noticing the codec, you're noticing that the, the Sodaton Radar is, is, um, jamming right now. Yeah, I'm jamming out my radar. <laughs> that reminds me of, like, the Charles Brown, the Charles Brown interview. Like, um, the, like, um, the new, the anchor newswoman was like, Ch so Charles Brown, did you actually uh, kill your wife? And he was just like, Jam. Wait, Jam. what? Living in America. <laughs> like the guy was high during the interview, so like he was he what he heard entirely was completely different from what from what um she was talking about. I feel good. I smell good. The ladies love me. I know the ladies love you. Wait, what? I know the ladies love you. Why is that, ladies? <laughs> he's he's re he's so high in that in the, in it and it's hilarious. Charles Brown interview. Look it up, guys. It's hilarious. It's actually on there. Yeah, it's a, it's actually pretty funny. I want to watch Snake, it. Yeah, yeah, well, we'll watch it afterwards. Living in America, I feel good. The ladies love me. Why is that, ladies? All oh, the dogs. Meryl. Yeah, puppy. It loves you. Meryl just said, "What's wrong, Snake? I thought you were good with dogs. I am good. See this? See? I'm good with dogs." <laughs> oh, because you have punch that loves you? Yeah, look, I'm good with dogs. Yeah. Don't kill it. Don't worry, you can't kill it. Can't? No, it doesn't die. Oh. It won't die. You killed the other ones. No, I didn't. There's like a mouse right there. No, that's a puppy. A puppy? Aww, you, you, you got a little puppy. My baby puppy. Wait. You punched the big dog and <laughs> actually we got a baby. Came on his ass. Ooh, that's a big tower. <gasps> this place is mine. Mabusita. Stay back, okay? <laughs> but the radar isn't working. 
And since we can't use the mine detector either... Leave it to me. Okay, so there's mines all over this floor. And here's the path. Meryl's gonna leave behind a path so that way we follow. So that way we don't get um, jumped by the mines. There's footsteps right there. Yeah, that's the path you gotta follow in order not to blow up. But here's the thing. I've played this game so much that I know a shortcut. What's the shortcut? You'll see the shortcut. So Meryl makes this big ass path that you have to follow. But if you're if you if you actually played this game a lot, then you pretty much know the secret path already. So what do you think? Pretty good, huh? Pretty I good. Were. But so I'm we better. Thought, when Mantis dove into my mind, I was able to see where the mines were placed. Are you impressed? Well, a little bit. Only a little? Yeah. Watch this. Watch this. I know the secret path. What? <laughs> <laughs> you just walked down the middle? Yeah, I just walked straight. Sniper Wolf gonna shoot her, shoot her in the ass? Meryl. What is Meryl. Meryl, get down! Meryl! Meryl! Don't reach your gun. Don't reach your gun. See what happened? You reach your gun and you see what happened? You die? No, she's not dead. Oh. Snake. The bad ending actually involves letting her die. But I'm getting the good ending. I am a rookie after all. Don't worry, Meryl. Those are rookies' eyes. Even I know that. It's the oldest trick in the book. The sniper's using me for bait to lure you out. Damn. Shoot me, Snake. Damn. No. My gun. I forgot my codec frequency. I can't Damn. It by myself. Don't move. I promised. I wouldn't slow you down. I. I. I, I can still help. I want to help you. Quiet down. Save your strength. I was a fool. I wanted to be a soldier. But war is ugly. There's nothing glamorous about it. Snake, please save yourself. Go on living and don't give up on people. Don't forget me. Now get out of here. Meryl! Damn. Snake, it's a trap. A sniper's trick to lure you out. The sniper's waiting for you to go and help Meryl, so he can pick you off. Don't do it. Must be Sniper Wolf, Foxhound's best shooter. Snipers usually work in pairs, but this one's alone, huh? I know her. She can wait for hours, days, or weeks. It doesn't matter to her. She's just watching and waiting for you to expose yourself. Maybe so. Okay, so the first boss fight with Mer long. with um Sniper Wolf. Can you see this first Wolf boss fight sucks. There's nowhere to hide between here and the tower. I hate this she boss must be fight. On the second floor oh. of the tower. I mean, it's not it's not exactly hard, but I ha I still hate it nonetheless. Classic sniper's mm -hmm. position. At that distance, you won't be able to hit her with a standard weapon either. You'll need a sniper rifle. Colonel, take it easy. <sighs> Yeah, I know I'm, I'm gonna, gonna need a sniper Meryl, rifle, no and we need to backtrack in order to get it. Okay. Backtrack. Thanks. Yeah. Oh. What's wrong? Kind of like in Metroid. Nothing. Metroid was all about I'm just backtracking. you're willing to sacrifice yourself. You got the genes of a soldier, not a savior. Well, actually, we just played the first Metroid, and we really didn't. I, I don't think we far, did that much backtracking. I don't know what the hell my genes look like, and I don't care. But I do I know that when we record, when we inevitably I'm get to, to the Metroid Meryl. Prime series, um, we okay. will have to backtrack and constantly, it for someone else and it's painful. I'm gonna save Meryl for myself, yeah. Colonel. Don't worry. At least for the save. first first game and third game, it's at least fun. I understand. Second game gets I'm too sorry. boring too quickly. All right, so now, time for me to backtrack.
It's now time to, for the torture sequence, which is coming up after the boss fight. Which, luckily, I selected easy mode for. And I know some of you are just thinking, Wow, noob! Wow! You are the- you are terrible- you must be terrible at this game. And, yeah. The torture sequence is pretty much the reason why I have trouble with it. The torture sequence is just awful. Oh god, oh god, come on, come on, come on. Okay, come on. Alright, run, 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 run. No, 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 go away, go away, go away, uh, go away. See that wolf? Yeah. Scary, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Not that scary. It's kind of scary in a way. Mm-hmm. So now, time for me to backtrack and go get the sniper rifle. And I will be taking those, re those mm -hmm. that ammo, thank you. Thank yeah, you very much. Oh, you're full of rations. Right? I'm full of rations. Yeah, four of them. I think that's the max you can hold. Or maybe up to six. So now, do you know how far we need to backtrack? How far? You are going to hate this, but we're going to have to backtrack almost all the way back. From the beginning? Almost all the way back. Almost all the way back. Huh. Okay, so now I got to get in my box. Where's my box? There's my box. You don't see me. You don't see me. Alright, so now... I just gotta grab a whole bunch of stuff real quick before I actually head out for real. Just a missile. I need to grab all the stuff I can grab. Yeah, it's too late. It's too late. Maybe I can do it now? Nope! Nope, he saw me! It didn't work. It didn't work. I was not close enough to the wall. Luckily, I can open up these doors now. And I got some Dizapam. Which isn't really that helpful, to be honest. All it, all it really is is just pills. You got the night vision. Nice. There you go. I just used it up for no reason because I don't need it. What is it for, though? It doesn't really do anything. Well, not that I'm aware of. I've heard it that it's supposed to steady your aim with the gun, but um, to be honest, with the with any gun, you can just hold it perfectly stable, except for the sniper rifle. That is shit. Just just get out of his get out of that field of vision, so that way he can't see you. You could basically be on the other side of the room and he won't see you. You know that's how that's how that's how bad their field of vision is. You need to be right up in front of them in order for them to see you. <laughs> like if if my hand was all the way on the other on on this side of the room was all the way touching the screen, you would not be able to see it if you were a guard. And then it, all of a sudden, you would be able to see it. You guys didn't see, but he just did like a, he just did like a face like, Oh, hey you! <laughs> like the guards, they, like the guards when they see you, they're like, hey you! And games nowadays, they see you a hundred yards. Yeah, they do. It doesn't matter how far you're at. Does it not matter in the slightest. But look at this. Here's, here's a cool shortcut. If you have the box, and you just wait here, in this truck... For a, for a good amount of time, just wait. It'll take you back to where you came from. Back to the beginning. Really? Yeah, it will. It's kind of like a good teleportation, I guess. Like, you just go back in and then do a drive back? Yeah, they'll drive back so to the beginning. Load? To the heliport, huh? But hey, at least we now have access to a certain ventilation shaft that a guard was blocking before. Hmm. 
<laughs> Special delivery. There's a box for Ryan. Special delivery to Ryan. It's apparently Secret Agent Solid Snake. Okay, so now we can go over to this side. See, there was a guard blocking this area before, but now we can crawl in it. Why is he blocking it? He was sleeping in front of it. Oh. He was sleeping in front of it while standing up. I, I was that at work once already. Huh? <laughs> you did that at work once? <laughs> almost. <laughs> wow. I almost fall asleep while standing. How can anybody actually fall asleep while standing it's gas. up? Hmm? It's gas. No, it's not gas, it's water. Water? Yeah, yeah. and I'm drowning. I'm drowning. Use the max. It'll still work. I don't think a gas mask works like that. I just think it like it decirculates gas. Mm -hmm. It prevents you from breathing gas. But I don't think gas masks work underwater. You can try it. Did Hideo Kojima actually go through the effort of actually trying to program that in? I mean, I gotta remember that this isn't this isn't like real life. This is a video game. There are some things that do work and some things that don't. I mean, if it works in real life, then I would love to try it in a game. But first, I'd want to try it in real life first. Mm -hmm. So now we're back to where we started over here. We're back to where the tank was. Yay! And now we gotta go back down to where Revolver Ocelot's boss fight was. Head down two floors. Basement two. Basement two. Oh, that guard! That guard's like right in front of me. That guard was right in front of me. Okay, so now, I gotta play this very carefully, very strategically. Okay, okay. So you see that guy? See that guy? I just gotta wait for him to turn around, and then I'm gonna snap his neck. Mm, there's no one here, I'll, I'll walk back. <laughs> there we go, all right. So now, I need to use the thermal goggles. Oh shit, I didn't know that. PSG-1, that's the sniper rifle. It's actually the PS-1. PSG-1. You got a PSG <laughs> uh, sure, PS-1, whatever. You, you can use that Hurry against Sniper Wolf. Meryl. Oh, and I also got a save. You caught Snake? You called about your Soliton radar? In China they say, rashness brings success to few, misfortune to many. Snake go forward when it's safe, but retreat when there's danger. You'll just have to play it by ear depending on the circumstances. Thanks Mei Ling. Good advice. Very good advice. Okay, now that that's taken care of, let's head back to Meryl as fast as we can. I'm coming to save you, Meryl! Come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up! No, 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 no! Okay, okay, I gotta use a ration, I gotta use a ration. Okay, 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 but I'm, okay, running, 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 No! Everywhere! No, no, no! Don't kill me! No, 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 no,
Running, 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 running. Alert. 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 I know, I know, I know, I know. Shut up! Shut up! Beer box. God damn it. God damn it. I am going to die. You know what? Just kill me. 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 Because screw you guys. Fuck you guys. Fuck you. Well, now I got to get the PSG one again. You saved it. Well, it doesn't matter anyway. Oh. It saved me at the checkpoint, but it didn't save me from getting it. See, look. <coughs> I don't have it anymore. I don't have it anymore. Ah, shit. Yeah, aw shit indeed. Okay, okay, turn around. Turn around, guard. Come here, guard. Come here, guardy, guardy, guardy. It's my doggy. A guard darg. That's what he is. <gasps> ah, shit! He died. No, he's not dead. No, I didn't die. I knocked him out, but I didn't I didn't kill him. I was supposed to snap his neck. <coughs> Ooh, I see him right there. I kind of just want to I kind of just want to I just kind of just want to There we go. Now you're dead. <laughs> yes, return to your normal routine. Yes, return to your normal routine. Just go, just go, just go, just go back, go back, go back, go back. Okay, good, good. Ration. Okay, never mind. But I will take this one, and I will go in here. This part, I don't enjoy this part. I don't enjoy backtracking for the PSG-1. Fuck! Damn it! Damn it! I didn't make it in time! I heard that. I heard that. Ring! Great! 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 Damn. Fuck you! Yes, please go away, please. No! God damn it! God damn it! God damn it! Go away! Leave me alone! No! God damn it! Fuck you! Fuck you, asswipe! You know what? I'm just gonna use a SOCOM. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Shut up. Don't jinx it! Don't jinx it, Brock! You're jinxing it. Don't jinx it. Oh, God damn it. I hate this. I hate this. Okay, I think we're good now. No, come on! I'm so angry right now. 
You cannot tell, but these are screams of rage right now. I am pissed right now. Finally, the way it should be. All right, now that I, that's taken care of, can I please just go back to the elevator and head to where I want to go, please? Thank you, game. Thank you. I hate that part. I hate that part so much. I mean, I love this game, but I also hate that part, you know? Hold it, go back. I hate the backtracking for the PSG1. I kind of just wish I could just get it early on in order, in order to avoid that altogether. Also, I don't have cardboard box A, so I'm going to need to head all the way back the normal way. And by the way, don't worry, the lasers are gone now. That's right, you can applaud me. Woo and this is where we where Deep Throat would call, saying about how he would want to deep throat me. Oh, there's tons of mines. Don't mind if I do, I'm just gonna take all of them, thank you. I'll take that. And I will take that. And I will take that and I will take that and I will take that dun 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 running across the minefield dun 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 give me that ration it's a delicious ration the rations are so tasty, so juicy, so delicious. So all over the all over the top. So delicious in every single way. It's still sending. It's still sending? Mm -hmm. Just how long the video was. Oh yeah, that's right. Wasn't it like five minutes? Yeah. Only got like I guess About you five percent. You know you could probably trim it down just to the point where where we need to show the fourth ball break in moment. Um, I get I guess you could just trim it down to that. They gotta go fast from the way I use your Wi-Fi. Are you using the Wi-Fi? No. Well then I'm gonna need to give you the password after this, alright? Mm -hmm. I can't give it to you now, because if I did, then other people are just gonna wanna use my Wi-Fi as well. Yeah. Like some person watches this and they see, they hear me talking about my password and then I'm just like, Oh no, I know his password. Hey, I'm going to take it from him. But they, they got to know where you live. That's true as well. You never should give away your address. No. Nope. Never give away your address. That's a bad thing. Cause fuck that. Fuck that. Hey, look, there's a guard over there. I like how he doesn't even see me. I like how he really doesn't see me when I'm right up in front of him. See, look at this. I'm in front of him, and he doesn't... I, he wouldn't even be able to see me if I was up in front of him like that. Really? Good old video game logic. You have to be close, like, like, at least like five feet away from him. Yeah, you gotta be five feet in front of him. Like I said before, my hand, like near the computer screen, you can't see it. That's then, like five feet. And then you're up close, That's you like can see it. He, he, he only sees it three feet. Jeez, he has bad, I think they have bad eyesight. They have the worst eyesight. 
All right, so now that I got the, P the PSG-1 or the sniper rifle, I will have to tell you that this thing sucks. I hate this thing. You know why? Why? Because th what it does, the aiming. I'm not touching a single thing. It just moves automatically. This is what I hate about it. You kind of f need to fight against it. Huh. But that's such as that's part of the sniper wolf fight, you know? You got to use that thing. I kind of wish I could just use a Nikita missile and then just fire a missile at her like that. But that's not until the second boss fight with Sniper Wolf. All right, I got a ration. In Russia, we eat nothing but rations. Ah, oh, come on! Get away from me, wolf! <laughs> Goofy yell. <laughs> That's not the Goofy yell. No, the Goofy yell is Goofy going... Wait, where am I going? Where am I going? Backward. I lost track of where I was. <laughs> I was getting dark. <laughs> I lost track of where I was. I wasn't looking. You might have to use your night vision. Oh, here's your puppy. Right now in circles. I'm gonna use this ration. Go over here, use that. And now, I will begin the fight. For real. This thing. That thing? Piece of shit. That sniper rifle is garbage. Okay, here we go. So now what I gotta do is I gotta do this. Come on! No! And that's the worst part about this boss fight. When, when Sniper Wolf shoots you, she completely spins you around. So you can't like stay, you can't like stay sitting still the entire time. You pretty much have to get out of it and then just prepare for the next bet for the next one. Ding! No! God damn it! That's really hard for me. I won't do it. Yeah, you you couldn't. I bet you couldn't. No. All right. Now let's try. Let's try again. There we go! There we go, there we go, there we go. Damn it! I got her! I got her! Yay! Okay, I only have three bullets left, so I gotta make sure they count. Where is she? Where is she? Oh, I got her! Got her! Good! But luckily, new ammo crates will fill up, so... I just need to walk over, and then there's more ammo. Yay! Infinite ammo. Damn it! All right, now I gotta use a ration. You can get it. 
Oh no, it's moving automatically. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. Okay, good. Okay, good. One more shot. Damn it! I missed. And and it wasn't even my fault. The sniper was just like steering itself on its own. Really weird. It's and fierce. fucked up. That's fucked up. Mm -hmm. This is definitely one of the main reasons why I think this game deserves a remaster. It does. Boom. Yeah! Okay, good. Now that that's taken care of, we can prepare for the not so hard torture sequence when you play on easy mode. When you play on normal mode, for me, it's hard. Very hard. It's very hard in normal mode. And then in hard mode, it's fucking impossible. <clears throat> so you keep, so here's what you do. You walk down this hallway and then you, then you kind of wonder, where's Sniper Wolf's body? You're kind of wondering, where's her body? And you're trying to find it, you can't find it. You look around the entire place, you go upstairs, so that way you try to see if you can find it. Ooh, there's there's ammo crates right here. Thank you. <laughs> I didn't even know that was over there. So you go upstairs, and you look for Sniper Wolf's body, and look, there's no body. There's where's, the, where's the body? But there's blood. Where's the body, though? But where's the body? That's the real question. Where's the body? And so then you just walk into the door, and then all of a sudden... Don't move! <clears throat> it's hard to miss when you're this close. Toss your weapon over here. Slowly. You know I have multiple guns on me right now. <laughs> you are a fool to come back here. Stupid man. A lady sniper, huh? Didn't you know that two-thirds of the world's greatest assassins are women? Do you want to die now? Or after your female friend? Which will it be? I'll die after I kill you. Is that right? Well, at least you've got spirit. I am Sniper Wolf. And I always kill what I aim at. Oh, I dig the sexy accent she's got. Special prey. Got it. Huh. Oh, I've left my mark on you. I cut him? I won't forget it. Until I kill you. You're all I think about. Jeez, imagine her as a girlfriend. Take him away. I imagine she would just fucking kill you during when having sex. <laughs> Don't kill me yet. I'm from the man. Leave it to me. I want no more episodes like that. Don't. Yes, he's my target. My mind. I can control this. Okay. Yeah, I'm controlling it with the D-pad. Do you know who I am? No, I no. That one day I would meet you. The man who stole my eyes was rightly mine. The man who stole my birthright. Forget it. Your body is strapped down tight. Me? I'm the man you stole everything good from. And now, after the sacrifice of our brothers, after 30 long years, finally, the two of us meet. The brother of light and the brother of dark. Solid's twin brother, Liquid Snake. 
Do you need his DNA too? Yes. I want a sample while he's still alive. We stuck still there. Alive. <laughs> when we do that. We yes. Do that. Yes. yes. Then we'll be able to cure them. No. We still have to get our yes. hands on Big Boss's DNA. Big Boss. Have they given in to our demands yet? Not yet. <clears throat> they won't give in. They're all hypocrites, every one of them. Is that your opinion as a curd? They always put politics first. That's right. That's why they want to avoid any leak about their precious new nuclear weapon. Boss, it looks like our friend is awake. Yeah, I'm awake. Hey, brother. Hey, brother. Dear brother, it is me, Liquid Snake. Don't you think? And now he's shirtless. <laughs> or should I say, Big Brother? Full of a small I'm head. Sure. Anyway, it doesn't matter. He has you a small and head. I are both the last. Yeah, the, yeah. The torso makes his head look small. Boss. It's me. Really? Then what? Oof, those idiots. All right, Raven. I'll be right there. They're not responding to our demands. Dear we brother, do you like the bed I made plan. you? Damn America. Why am I tied up like this? Looks like you read them wrong. Something Sniper fun. Wolf is into Always some very kinky stuff, dear team. brother. They must think they've got something up their sleeves. So it's come down to it, has it? We're going to launch that nuke and ride it all the way into history. I've got to take care of some launch preparations. You're in charge here, <coughs> Ocelot. What about you? Wanna stay for the show? I'm not interested. It's time to feed the family. So you prefer your wolves to my show, huh? Ocelot, don't screw up like you did with the chief. Yes, I know. That was an accident. I didn't think a pencil pusher like him would be so tough. Well, his mental defenses were reinforced by hypnotherapy. Boss, what about that ninja? He's killed 12 men. Whoever he is, he's some kind of lunatic. Bastard took my hand. How could he have gotten in here? Perhaps there's a spy among us. Mantis is dead. We've also got to find out what killed Baker, an octopus. We're short-handed, so make this little torture show of yours as short as possible. Torture? This is an interrogation. As you wish. See you later, brother. Oh, that camera angle. Your woman is still in this world. Meryl. Catch you later, handsome. Once she picks a target, she doesn't think about anything else. Sometimes she Look at this camera angle. Them before she kills them. <laughs> Good camera angles. Finally, <laughs> just yeah. the two of us. How are you feeling? Not bad. Got a nice nap on this revolving bed. Imagine what that would look like in HD. <laughs> Glad to hear that. This is some <laughs> bed, all right. I'm about to show you some of its nicer it. feet. Yeah, that would look awesome. Oh, don't worry. They're all there. Washington was taking quite a chance sending you here. Someone must have had a lot of faith in your skill, huh, carrier boy? Okay, so what he's talking about there. <laughs> Carrier boy, <laughs> that's a real, that's a plot point. Colonel, <coughs> by the way, you all right? You got an Thank optical you. disc from President Baker, didn't you? What if I Damn did? It. Is that the it's all right, I got one? it. He lost no his other hand. Data? What do you mean? Yeah, because Gray Fox cut it off. Not, that's fine. Is Meryl okay? She's not <laughs> dead yet. <coughs> Wolf must have been feeling generous. Okay, so for this torture part, um, if you submit, if you press select during the torture sequence, you basically surrender and you get the bad ending, alright? But the only way to get the good ending is you have to press circle. You have to spam circle like crazy. Luckily, since I'm playing on easy mode, this will be more of a breeze than it will. 
But in Peace Walker, oh boy, I'm not looking forward to that. Huh. That torture sequence. I am going to have. To, I. I'm going to have. I'm going to have to spam the triangle button so much that my hand will fall off. Press the circle button repeatedly to regain your strength. When you've had enough, press the select button to submit. Yeah, don't press the select button if you want zero, the bad ending. The game is over. If you don't there want are it. No I want friend. the good ending. Give me the good ending don't with Meryl. Think about using auto bad ending, Meryl Round dies. Hmm. I'm going to run a high voltage electric current through your body. If it's just for a short time, it won't kill you. But I never heard that before. You're a tough guy, Snake. But I've got some bad news for you. You're no POW. You're a hostage. There's no Geneva Convention. No one is coming to save you. Starting to feel a little scared. Good. You should be. Okay. Let's get started. Alright, here we go. <clears throat> Alright, ready for this? Okay, here we go. How did you like that? Shall we go again? Alright, go on. Go on, Ocelot. I can take it. I can take it. I can take it. I can take it. Come on. I got this. 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 Had enough yet? We're not finished yet. Okay, come on, come on. One more time, one more time. You're a strong man. That's hard to do well, even on easy mode. Now, I think. You're the boss's brother, all right. Your brother, he's an amazing man. Who else could shoot down two F-16s with a hind helicopter? The Les Enfants Terribles project was not <laughs> for Les me. Enfants Terribles! <laughs> the one man who could make my dream into a reality. I'm Russian, but I also can do a French accent. Oh, oh I found talent! <laughs> Sacre bleu! All right, so now, so now, while you're in the in the jail cell, you need to quickly do a huh? quick codec call. Looks like I got a room. This is why I had to remember Otacon's codec call. The DARPA chief. Whew. What a stench! Ew, he's smelly. My clothes. Oh, here's Johnny again. Mm -hmm. So here's a big joke that that's part of Johnny's character. Um, one thing that Johnny does a lot in the Metal Gear Solid series is he does nothing but shit his pants. <laughs> he does nothing but shit his pants all the time. Shit his pants. I'm serious, Brock. That's a, that's his big running joke in the series. He just shits his pants. He's serious. He's gonna shit his pants. So now I need to contact Otacon. Otacon, are you still okay? And look at that. Thanks to the stealth Something's different about Snake's profile picture. There's no shirt. Yeah, there's no shirt. I was wondering when you'd ask, what but he, he still I've has that captured. though. He still has the bandana, yeah. What cell? There's a big torture machine nearby. Okay, I know it. It's close. I'll be there right away. Thanks. All right, so now after contacting Otacon, I need to call Colonel Campbell. Snake, are you okay? I've been better. How's Mara? They've got her. Damn. Damn. Snake, 
The government is Damn, Snake. To give in to their Damn. We're trying to That's how you gotta say it. You gotta say it with Come a on, really girl. gravelly voice, like, Damn. Damn, Snake. Damn. 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 More gravelly. Damn. 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 You gotta, you gotta really gargle it in your neck. Damn. 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 There you go. Damn. Can't tell the damn. Damn. You've changed a lot. It's almost like trying to do a Batman voice, almost. Secret advanced nuclear weapons research. Damn. Does the White House know? Damn. How deep does it go? Damn, I can't take a shit. <laughs> Is that how Snake takes a shit? He's just like, damn. Damn, I can't take a shit. I guess Shadow would do the same thing. Even damn. <laughs> damn, not here. Possible deniability, huh? Yes. Tomorrow, well, Sonic. <laughs> I always keep bringing up Sonic. I really shouldn't bring it up. Why? Because this is Metal Gear. This isn't Sonic. That's right, Snake. Oh, I brought it up then. Because you kept saying, because we kept saying, damn. Or dealt with the issue of TMDs. This has to do with when it comes to games that have the most America's have universal memes and jokes, power. Sonic and Metal Gear have the most. Circumventing the Constitution. Please. Oh, the damn. Snake. Well, they have the more universal memes, all right? Because you memes that I could pretty much use can. in any sort of situation. In that case, tell me the truth about this. I can't really use like Castlevania's like, like "What is a man?" sort of meme in this details. scenario, because it doesn't make any sense for a the joke at least. So serious. Why don't you give in to their demands? Let them have Big Boss's remains. Big you Boss. See? Or is there some reason that you can't do that? Something you haven't told me about. Publicly, the president has been very vocal in his opposition to eugenics experiments. We don't want the existence of the genome army to go public. And that's the only reason? Huh. Hell with you. I'm sorry. The corpse of the DARPA chief is lying right here next to me. Poor man. But it's strange. He looks and smells like he's been dead for days. All his blood's been drained out, too. Drained. Maybe to slow down decomposition? I have no idea. Shit. But the chief only died a few hours ago, right? <laughs> you just, shit. You just shit said shit for no reason? Shit. What could it all be shit. 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 Something shit. Shit. You guys don't see it, but Brock is shit. constantly... Boy, look at it right now. Look at Ryan. Brock is turning his head constantly. Brock is turning his head constantly every single time. And he's saying shift every time he turns his head. Shit. 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 Oh, we're looking it right now. Look up. Type of Shit. Device that can <laughs> Look down. Shit. Look left. That arms tech Shit. Look left again. Shift. Shit. With three <laughs> card keys. And where are those keys? I've got one of them. I don't know where the other two are. Besides, I'm locked up here. We've got no choice. Forget about the keys. Your top priority now is to destroy Metal Gear itself. I'm sorry to have to lay it all in your lap. You're all I've got. Bust out of there and get to the communications tower. Also, what? I know it's asking a lot. Meryl, right? Yeah. I'll save her. Thanks. I promise, Colonel. I will. I will save Meryl. So, Otacon, have you got to fuck her too? Yeah. Otacon. Probably. I'm headed your way now. Can't you just relax? Come on, Otacon, hurry up! I don't want to go through the torture sequence a second time, even though I'm gonna have to in inevitably with this one. All right, Johnny, Johnny, go on, go, go, Johnny. You gotta kiss the shits. You gonna go shit yet? <coughs> He's only sneezing right now, so. Come on, Johnny. Let me see you take a shit. Go on, Johnny. Go, Johnny. Go on, Johnny. Go on. Go on, Johnny. You feeling constipated yet? Shut up! Shut up in there, will ya? <laughs> That's funny. Whenever I throw a punch, he just says, Shut up! Shut up in there, will ya? I'm training. Shut up. Shut up in there, will ya? Shut up in there, will ya? I'm training. Let me train. I'm training. Seriously, this, this, he, shut up. he always says shut up every time you throw a punch. It's hilarious. Or when you do this. What's he doing? 
<laughs> what are you doing? I'm knocking on the wall. Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> I barely use this in the game, but this you can use this to attract to attract guards' attention. Oh yeah, I did it before. Hey, dude. It looks like I'm jacking off almost. Nate, it's showtime. Ocelot wants you. Alright, time for another torture sequence. You think I can survive the second one? Let's no. hope I can. No. Oh, I bet I can. I said no. No. Okay. No. I bet I, I can. No. 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 Press the circle no. Button no! Gain your strength. When you've had enough, I'm already tapping it constantly. No, I you tap it. When your life reaches you really zero, wanted to uh, try? Yeah. There are no it's really hard, dude. Friend. It's really hard. You gotta tap it like crazy fast. You know, the other game you that tapped really fast to my... Oh, I almost broke my Among the Mujahideen gorillas. <laughs> I was known in I did, I, I, did, I did some other game before. You know what? We'll have you do the button tapping in Peace Walker, then, okay? What's Peace Walker? That's, that's um, Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker. Oh. That does the same thing? Peace Walker is what we're going to do after Metal Gear Solid 3. We'll do one, and then we'll do this one, two, three, then Peace Walker, then four, and then finally the Phantom Pain. I guess we could also okay, do Ground Zeroes and go. Rising Revengeance, which is that which is the spin-off game with Raiden. I think that's on PS4. Yeah, but I have them on PC as well. Oh. oh. How did you like you that? Go get it. Go get here it. We go again. All right, here we go. Let's keep doing it. All right. Go get it. Go get it. I know you go go get it. Go get it. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Ah, die. Enough yet? Die. We're now I, I could just tap it, it normally. I could just tap it normally because this is the last one I got to survive now. Ah. Look at that, I survived. Yay! You're a strong man. Well, that's enough for now. <laughs> you love playing with the microphone, don't you? <laughs> uh huh. Imperialism, totalitarianism. At least you're not hurting people's ears. Oh, I that voice. <laughs> yeah, but by accident. What the phone? It wasn't your fault. Today mm -hmm. has no, that, that work, I've been, I've been, I've been, I've been you're dropping shit now. Butterfingers. First one is the truck, no then the second one, I grab my, flew out of the freezer, and there's a big ice chunk on my, system. on my box, and it falls off and hit the floor. So you're in this for money? I don't need money. And everybody tell me I work on bad. I want Russia to be reborn. Mother Russia is not Russian. It's rations. <laughs> <laughs> Moscow, Moscow, come and have a drink again. You will never leave again. Ha, 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 ha. Hey, Moscow, Moscow, come and have a drink again. You, you will never kitty? leave again. Oh, it's a cute, cute kitty kit picture. You want it? Nah. It's I... at it's pet's part. <laughs> you have to get in here. All right, so let's talk to Otacon again. Otacon, he now. saves the game. Can't you just relax? No, that's Mei Ling. <laughs> no, that's Mei Ling. Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up, man? Shut it up, smells man, in here. You? I'm just gonna jack off next to this dead body. Shut up in there, will ya? <gasps> oh! You okay, Snake? Yeah. Nothing new to report. Snake, is there anything I can do? Yeah. My arm hurts. Now, if you had, if I had a vibrating controller, it would vibrate, like, it would vibrate just to heal the pain of, of me bashing the circle button. Mm -hmm. And I could just have it on my arm and just, just help it relax. But, the, like, but too bad this controller doesn't vibrate. Like, you find out putting your dick and get bored out of it. 
I was just vibrating. I'm not a very good talker. You know, it's funny. I really should have been playing this Tell on the PS3. Then the then the controller could be vibrating constantly. That's a tough and one. we could get it's Psycho bad. Mantis saying, You like Castlevania, don't it's not you? A happy topic for me. And that's kind of a bummer too, because I have Castlevania Wait. on my memory card there on the PS3. So if he actually said that, that, that would be amazing. Um Big Boss. Good luck on my PS3. Big Boss. I have over 100 games on it. He's, he's gonna list all of them, right? No he probably would, yeah. Yeah, you might be sitting there for about two hours just talking about it. But it would, <laughs> but it would only be PS1 games, so. so. Just PS1? Is just PS1. Oh, I thought it'd be PS3. Really no, no, it'd just be PS1 Boy, games said. because Metal Gear Solid That's is a PS1 know. game. Oh, uh, I have like five or six PS1 no, games on it. He'd probably say like, no. "You like Crash Bandicoot, don't wow. you?" And there's like three of, there's Besides, like three of them. There's CTR in it. <laughs> there's it's probably four Crash games. There's a yep. couple other games too. That's the I know for sure that um, if you were playing the game, if we were playing the GameCube remake. He'd be like, you you've been out. playing Legend of Zelda, haven't you? You've been playing Last Super Mario Sunshine. Place. You've been <laughs> playing Sonic Heroes, haven't you? Have a real family either. He would n he would just it's note just all the games that I've school. played that were for GameCube. They weren't even blood related, and he was much older than me. You've been playing Luigi's Where Mansion, you? haven't you? You've been playing He's Godzilla, dead. haven't you? No, Godzilla's <laughs> PS3. <sorry. laughs> I was playing around with you. Snake. No, it would just be Is only GameCube games. After you've been through as many wars as me, you've been to trust anyone. Sonic Heroes. You've been playing Shrek 2 on the GameCube, haven't you? Remember, remember that actually? Yeah, but we recorded. Yeah, we recorded it, but no. we never finished it. There was another. You know, if we were to get extra here. members for the for the group, the I would. I would. I would want to go back and finish and that. The only member of Fox mm -hmm. ever to the code gets name boring. Fox. Playing Shrek. Great yeah. Fox. Oh, I just noticed. Um, in this part, in this part of the game, <coughs> Solid Snake um said that Big Boss That's was true. his father. We did. In and he also said that Roy there Campbell and we Gray Fox are two of his side. closest friends. Snake's his friends? Yeah, friends. Snake's friends. Oh, I didn't know you had friends. War is no reason. Well, yeah, he does, and I guess Otacon would count as a friend too. I, first I mean, they just met in this game, but in future games, they would become best friends. Huh. But he didn't look like a prisoner to me. He was always so cool and We were just too busy talking about talking about like how Psycho Mantis could fuck with the game. No. We never talked about our personal lives. Sort of an unwritten rule. The next time I saw him on the battlefield, we were enemies. We were fighting barehanded in a minefield. I know it sounds strange to most Are you using your nose to tap stuff on the phone? Yeah. I've done that before. Men in their game. I've actually used my They're tongue before. Animals. You're right. Yeah, so we are animals. Satisfying. So if you were friends, then how do you explain the ninja's behavior? <laughs> I don't know. <sighs> it's your genes. Ooh. They make you That's predisposed so towards violence. So I really satisfying. like talking about genes. Right now, you. Me. Right now, we're just watching yeah, some satisfying videos right, right now while you guys are paying attention to the were, gameplay. Or even what they look like. I guess I got into genetics because we should be reacting to, to this instead, instead of play, doing a so let's play. About DNA. <laughs> yeah. I thought if I'll I studied do my like genetic structure, like these. I'd find out who I really You know, was. if there were any I videos that I wanted to film reactions to, I could um, I would want to react to um the CDI Memory Zelda and Mario games. Sure, because those games are super hard to emulate. Those games are so hard to emulate, and I would not want to record those under any so circumstance. But I would want to react to the cutscenes. Your fate? I've... I'm sorry, I have no idea. Of course not. You're a scientist, not a fortune teller. Okay. So now let's see if Johnny will shit himself. Come on, Johnny. Oh, he's got the shits! <laughs> oh, my stomach. Oh, damn it. There he goes. There he goes. <laughs> there he goes. He's taking it. He's gonna take a shit. He's taking a shit. He's taking a shit. Yeah, go take your shit. I'm gonna take a shit. How are you taking a shit? Hmm? How are you making him take a shit? You just had to wait until he would take a shit. 
That's all. <laughs> hey, at least we, we killed some time. Hey, there's Otacon. He's invisible right now. Hey, I'm here. Where? Hey, Otacon. Yes, get me out of here. It's me, Otacon. Wow, they even captured you. Hurry, get me out of here. It, let me go. That hurts. Hurry up. Is that how you ask a guy a favor? Let me go. Jeez, it's like an animal's cage. Oh, what a smell. Because of him. Oh, yeah, that's right. The Derpa Chief. Yeah, it's the Derpa Chief. You don't hurry up and get me out of here. I'll be laying next to him. Those bastards. This lock won't open with a security card. You need a key like the soldiers carry. So what are you doing here, then? I... I thought you might be hungry. If you need more food, I can bring some more later. Also, I got you this level 6 card. It'll get you out of that torture room. Here, take this, too. What's this? It's a handkerchief. I got it from Sniper Wolf. Oh! I don't know why, but she's nice to me. Sounds like Stockholm Syndrome to me. Yeah, that's Stockholm Syndrome, Otacon. I taking care of the dogs here. After the terrorist yeah, in this part of the game, Otacon falls in love with Sniper Wolf. But Sniper Wolf stopped Who? Yeah, Otacon falls in love with asked. Sniper Wolf. Huh. She likes dogs. She must be a good person. Nah, Otacon, it's it's Stockholm Syndrome. You have She's Stockholm Syndrome. Meryl. Well, that's all I can do. They're planning to launch a nuke. I've got to stop them. Then you have to get past the communications tower. First, you have to get me out of here. Come on, I'm trying my best. That guard's got the key. You'll have to take him out. Give me a break. I'm no soldier. I can't take anybody out. Hey, I got a text for a second. Killed. Oh, it's oh, it's your video. You, it finally sent through. It did? Yeah. Huh. Oh, jeez. Yeah, it's it just sent. See you later. Why it took that Wait. long? Man, I look very dumb with a, with a bandana on. I just realized that. It, you know, it took, took about an hour. Jesus. Okay, so now, now what I need to do is I need to lay down. All right, and now what I need to do is I need to activate this, activate the ketchup. So now, and so now it looks like I'm bleeding. You just lay on top of it? I have to play dead for this part. I have to play dead. What the hell? Watch. Just have to wait. Wait for it. Bam! I snapped Johnny's neck. But don't worry, he'll be in the next game. He took he just took a shit and plus he's gonna shit more. He took his shit, died, and now he's gonna take another shit. <clears throat> Alright, so now let's grab this. There we go. I'm back in my suit. And also, I feel like Auto Ocelot, Revolver Ocelot, might have booby trapped it. Yep, he did. He booby trapped all my stuff. a close one snake ocelot you'll pay for that yeah you will ocelot well so i i think we're gonna end this episode here so that is all for this episode everybody if you guys enjoyed leave a like leave a comment share with your friends check us out on twitter, twitter. daily motion and twitch and most importantly subscribe, subscribe. my name's ryan I'm Brock. And we will see you guys in the next, next video. video. Peace. Peace! Oh, wait, I don't have a hat. I forgot I had a hat. I forgot I was wearing a bandana instead of a hat. Let's well, do this.